For today's video, we are going to be planting placentas and trees. How crazy does that sound? <laughs> Mike has got the tree for it. We're going to put two here together. How special is that? Look at how empty our house is. This you ready? You hear it? Welcome to today's video. I'm Jody, and on this channel we share our family vlogs, some of my mommy videos, and have product reviews from time to time. So if you're new and this interests you, please consider subscribing and becoming part of our YouTube family. And as always, if you want to know more about anything you see here on this channel, be sure and check the links in the description below this video or leave me a comment because I love connecting with you guys there. And yes, this title is not clickbait. It is what it says it is. We are going to be planting trees and placentas today. <laughs> I don't really know where to start other than yes, I have placentas to plant. Um, they are Sindels and Lucas's. I had home births with them and we were given the chance to save them in case I wanted to encapsulate them and take them to ingest the hormones. That isn't something really I was interested in and so the other option is since I'm not having the midwives dispose of them was to maybe plant them in our backyard under a tree and when Micah and I did that and we had Lucas's placentas we kind of forgot and we just planted the tree so that ended up in the freezer and then Sindel came along and so I kept her placenta as well and that is in the freezer too and what I think is kind of neat, Lucas and Sindel had the same birth date or essentially the same conception date. Lucas was born a day early and Sindel was born eight days late. But either way, they were due on the same day. And so putting their little placentas together just makes them feel more together, I guess. It's kind of special to me. I hope this doesn't gross you out and I don't intend to gross any of you out with this video by showing them to you. The next part is, is these trees that we are going to be planting over these placentas. They are little seedlings that I rescued from our front yard. Our neighbor lady, her sister planted the trees. There was like three or four of them out front and two of them were in our way for our driveway and we took them down and there was one left and it's been letting little ones grow and I, and I have been rescuing them and I have them in a bucket and what's really cool is Micah has some family property that has been through his grandparents, his parents, his cousins, his aunts, the family, family property and we are going to go plant these trees from here and these placentas from here out there and I am super excited about it and to bring you guys along and to vlog yet another day with you all. So let's go do this. To get started, I'm gonna get Cinder loaded up, grab the trees, grab those placentas and get headed out there. Lucas and Micah, they went out there already. We had some tables from our garage sales that we were taking back and then a cool eagle statue. I'll have to show that to you guys when we get there that Micah's grandpa carved. And so yeah, let's just get on the road and get out of here and catch up with those boys. I'm gonna grab our cooler bag here to put the placentas in. Sindel's gonna help me with it. Okay, good job, girl. So I realized I didn't quite explain myself very well. The reason they went separately is because that eagle statue and table could not fit in our car, so they had to take his van. So I thought it would be wise to call Micah and see if I should be grabbing anything else before I head out there and they want me to grab some pizza for lunch. And you guys, look at how empty our house is. This is crazy, it's really happening. We're getting excited. <laughs> Here's the trees that I rescued. There was like 16 in this bucket. I'm not sure how many there is now. We'll count them when we get out there. Oh, and it's heavy. This is where I rescued them from. And this is the tree they came from. All right, so I have to show you one more thing. Look what else happened today. Our realtor put this sticker on. That's a pizza check. Out here, 
obviously, and I'm gonna try and find them. I don't know where they are. Maybe they're riding, who knows? So pretty. There's Wraith, so Lucas must somewhere nearby. Oh, watch this. You ready? You hear it. Ah! <laughs> they found me. We forgot your helmet at home. Little Miss Luca. Yeah, he was awake. <laughs> Look at these two having a snack in the shadow of the tree. Fun times. Some of you guys probably remember Bella from our other videos. And there is this eagle statue that I told you that Micah was bringing out here. It's catching a fish. Pretty perfect above this pond. All right, the time has come. We're gonna go plant this stuff. Cause cousin Ryan's getting a hole going here. They were wanting a bigger bucket already. Yeah. for the baby's home to go in the hole over here. Micah's got the tree for it. Do it. You do it. You wish for something. I'm gonna put two here together. How special is that? Good idea, guys. Our helpers. All right, that's that. They're in the ground. So awesome. We have a handful more of these trees to plant, so we're going to go do that right now. I'm going to put one over here. How beautiful are the daisies in that pink tree? Another spot. How many you have left, babe? We have four left. Nice. Those look healthy. Or five, looks like. Dune buggy is getting some bouldering out here. <laughs> <laughs> Putting two in this spot. Gonna go plant the last ones. I see two bumpkins in there. <laughs> it's official. They're all planted. I'm gonna get them some water now and watch these kids run around and have some fun together. Oh, come on, little girl. Look at them over there. <laughs> so I think those are actually incense cedar trees, not just regular cedar trees. So when the wood burns from them, they smell really good which is kind of cool. But yeah, you guys have your little incubator baby homes together, you and brother. <laughs> now I'm headed to catch up with the guys. They're working on their dirt bike tracks, building them, I guess. So we're gonna go see, and I've got Micah's sunglasses I need to take to him. He left them back at the house. There they are. So they are creating a berm right here. That's epic. Yeah. Micah grew up riding his bikes out here, huh, babe? This is the track. We uh, we kind of did the Dukes of Hazard thing with some old Camaros. Yeah. I've jeeped. There used to be a mud hole over there, but now we're doing dirt bikes and quads, so. Fun stuff out here today, especially for the kids. Good job, buddy. Woo, be careful. And now we're gonna get headed home, guys. I've been inside editing a little bit while the babies were taking a nap. I've got some Michael Jackson playing on the TV over there. Micah's got his music happening out here in the garage. He hooked up one of his speakers. One of his friends, Otis, came over to help him work on building the engine in the GTO. So I'm gonna hop out there and show you guys a little bit what they're up to. Both babies are awake and out there right now as well. And then I'm gonna probably come inside and get our dinner made and call this a night.
for today's video, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please be sure and give it that giant thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching, as always, and we'll see you in our next video. Bye!